down from the night sky. So let's go straight to the ground. Here's your commentary team, Clive Tilsley and Andy Townsend. We all know this is an international friendly on the fixture list, but we also know that it's uh, games like this that help the manager finalise his plans for the bigger matches, the uh, competitive internationals ahead. And there's one or two new faces out there, Clive, which I'm really looking forward to seeing how they cope in this sort of atmosphere. the look of a, a close match to me, Andy. I am well and truly on the fence today, Mr Tilsley. I can't separate these two. Particularly as an Englishman, I think about Germany, I think about winning mentality that somehow we're as good as they are. England don't beat Germany. I, I guess there's a lot of countries in the world who, when it gets to a tournament, find the same problem against the Germans. They're good. Well, it is, and you know, more importantly with the Germans, you're, you're, uh, it's almost as if they have an extra man because their mentality, that willpower, as you've just been talking about, Clive, it's, it never accepts defeat, it doesn't know when it's beaten. Individually, they're not the greatest team anymore, that's a fact. They don't have a star-studded 11, but they have something else in that dressing room, in their back pocket, that they take onto the pitch with them. Hey, is it called belief? What it, I don't know what it is, but I tell you, if you could bottle it, you could be, make millions out of it. possibilities here. Oh, look at this! Going for goal! Off the keeper! Well, they made better use of the ball than that. Jostling for possession, determined defending. Thomas Muller. Miroslav closer. Ozil. He can make the other players around him look good. He directs the entire operation. Just got wonderful vision, has he? Just so aware of everybody in front of him. Big chance. Instant hit. He's made a right mess of that. It was well wide. No, he's got that all wrong, I'm afraid, Clive. And uh, he's let them off, basically, there. That's a waste. I think they're going to have to be in their best to win this one. Forward here, got a chance. Can't let it get away from him. Ula.
Germany. Scrambled away to safety. He's got a chance. Goalkeeper needed to make a save there. Closer looking to get at the opposition here. Through the there's a chance here. He'll try his luck. It's a goal for Closer. I don't know what the keeper was thinking about there. He just gives it them the goal. This guy's got ice running through his veins. He keeps such a cool head, such composure. That could be a crucial goal. He's put Germany in front. Red. with the ball Fred Cruz Miroslav closer Julio Cesar makes the save Schweinsteiger, Kedira, Mirislav closer. That's a brilliant finish. Where we go again. Scores 2-0. That's a very solid team performance we've just seen there, Clive. I think the manager will be absolutely delighted with what his players have given. He'll just say, more of the same, lads, and we've got this game in the bag. So we reach half-time. 2-0 the score with Germany leading. Let's take a look at the highlights from that. Here we go for the second half. Another 45 minutes to save up. Brazil have got a free kick here. He missed the target by miles there, high and wide. That's poor, because all that does is relieve pressure and allows the opposition to uh, get their shape again. Talent. Oh, lovely skill. So easy he goes past the defender. He's such an accurate cross of a ball, and they know it. And that's why, Clive, he's got people committing to getting into that penalty area. Brazil have forced a corner. Oh, and he caught hold of that one, but the keeper managed to save it.
with that tackle, did he? Attack broken up. Not easily shaken off the ball, is he? from the player there, Clive. He knew he was late and he knows it's a yellow. Man is going to make full use of his available substitutes, bringing on two of them here. Looking menacing here, they don't let him shoot. Get close to him, shut him down. Don't allow him to work your goalkeeper. Quarter one by Brazil. out of the keeper. That's a dreadful pass. One or two of his teammates are telling him so. Needs to wake up. Bastian Schweinsteiger. Kedira. Closer. decisions and it is a big decision to meddle with a winning team he's just trying to make sure they don't lose their grip on this game red Maybe save the game. Well, what do we know? We expected this to be a tight game, but look at the scoreline now. It's turned out to be a lot easier than they could have possibly expected. Oh, that's clever. Thomas Muller. He's taking them on, but there's some pretty flimsy defending out there. Repossession again. Couldn't 
dispossess him. He can't keep it in. They just wouldn't allow him time or space. Good defending. It's always a predicament whether to change a winning team, but the manager is looking to cement the victory now. This is a tactical change. Just uh, four more minutes now. Lam. Wins it on the flank. but it was his goal. Ah, oh, real captain's role played there, Clive. That's a lovely finish. Well, they've managed to find the back of the net, and I suppose it has given their fans something to cheer about. Bit of a mismatch, this. Scoreline's 3-1. There's the whistle for the end of the game, and as you can see, the final score here is 3-1. I don't know who your man of the match was, Andy, but I bet he was an attacker. Or oh, the forward play today, Clive, was wonderful. I really enjoyed watching this team boring players forward. So it's full time with the final score, 3-1. I'll leave you with the full match highlights, and until next time, I've been Jeff Stelling.